The expression of genes can be transcriptionally regulated. Such regulation is a critical feature of both eukaryotic and prokaryotic organisms. One of the classical systems used to investigate transcriptional regulation was originally investigated by Jacob, Manot, and Pardee. Their studies involved the transcriptional regulation of the genes used to ferment lactose in the bacterium Escherichia coli. Three genes clustered together on the chromosome are required for the bacterium to utilize lactose. These were determined to be the LAC-Z gene that codes for the enzyme, beta-galactosidase, the LAC-Y gene that codes for a lactose permease, and the LAC-A gene that codes for the enzyme, galactoside transacetylase. The LAC-P region is the promoter that is needed to transcribe the LAC-Z, LAC-Y, and LAC-A genes as a single polycystronic mRNA. The LAC-O region is an operator site that is involved in the transcriptional regulation of the LAC operon. The unit consisting of the LAC promoter, LAC operator, and the LAC-Z, LAC-Y, and LAC-A genes is called the LAC operon. Located near but not in tandem with the LAC region is the LAC-I regulatory gene that codes for an mRNA that is translated to produce a protein referred to as the LAC repressor. In the absence of lactose inside the cell, the LAC repressor protein is active. In its active state, the LAC repressor recognizes and binds to the LAC operator site. When the LAC repressor is bound to the LAC operator site, RNA polymerase is prohibited from recognizing the LAC promoter, and the LAC-Z, LAC-Y, and LAC-A genes are not transcribed. When lactose enters the cell, a small amount of it is converted to allolactose via beta-galactosidase. Allolactose binds to the LAC repressor. This causes a conformational change in the LAC repressor protein that prevents it from binding to the LAC operator site. Inactive LAC repressor is unable to bind to the LAC operator site. Without an active LAC repressor bound to the LAC operator site, RNA polymerase is able to bind to the promoter and a polycystronic messenger RNA is transcribed that includes the LAC-Z, LAC-Y, and LAC-A genes. This polycystronic messenger RNA is then translated to produce the beta-galactosidase, lactose permease, and galactoside transacetylase proteins. Therefore, the induction of the LAC operon enables the bacterium to efficiently transport lactose into the cell and metabolize it.